Hello everyone, today is November 6, 2021 and it's around 2.40 p.m. Now I'm at the Nihonbashi area. It's really close to the Tokyo station. And today I will be walking to Nihonbashi to Shin Nihonbashi through Mitsukoshi Mae. So all of them are Nihonbashi area. And uh, when Edo period starts at uh, 1603, this area was uh, really the center of the city. So many people, so many people are living there in Edo period, like one million people. And it was a commercial area since then. Even now, you know, this is the Takashimaya. Really vintage building, old style. There are many a department store and a fashionable restaurant and a boutique. So it, this area has been the the center of commercial area since 1603 <laughs> it means that uh, since 400 years ago this is the center of Tokyo. Now, of course, it has so developed, not like an Edo period, but still so many people are living, or, uh, of course, compared with before, uh, there are so many offices here because rental fees is so expensive around here, so people cannot leave. So as you see, there are so many offices around here. Or department store, shopping center, high brand store. to wait for the traffic light. So if I go down this street like uh, three or four minutes, you will find why this area is called Nihonbashi. Let's cross the intersection. So this is the Koredo Nihonbashi in the shopping center.
beautiful flower on the side row. So now you can see the big bridge over there, right? That is called Nihon Bashi. So Hashi, uh, Nihon means uh, you know Japan, and Hashi means bridge. So maybe if I say in English, this bridge is called the uh, Japan Bridge, Nihon Bashi. So that's why this, this area is called Nihon Bashi. Came from the name of this bridge. Really, really traditional bridge. And you can see the river here. And look at that. Oh my god, that is uh, awesome. Look at that cruising. Really, really old cruise, cruising, I mean, sh boat. And behind the boat, uh, yeah, compare that uh, boat in front, that is the more uh, bigger and clean. So meaning that uh, you can enjoy cruising from here. Look at this dragon. Can you see that? Another statue is here. Okay, this is the Nihon Bashi Japan Bridge. really have a long history you know and that is the Mitsukoshi department store Starbucks had uh, started uh, its Christmas decoration So you know this one the Mitsukoshi department store and this one too.
the architecture is really really old and but it's beautiful and uh, let me turn right and uh, take a look at the uh, on the street because uh, it looks really fun There are many shops, restaurants. <laughs> hey, this is a Vietnamese restaurant. This is a Doto Cafe, which is a chain cafe. old Korean restaurant craft beer market they can drink outside <laughs> playing with the cat and this is a Koredo Muromachi that is a Koredo Muromachi 3 and this one is a Koredo Muromachi 2 and there should be one as well maybe the next one this one It is a shopping center. This is a Japanese sweet shop, Wagashi shop, which is called Funabashiya. Other really stylish, fashionable store. Drinking wine outside. That is a that is a perfect. You know that is the main street, right? And uh, now we are on the side road. Look at that. This building is so beautiful. Really, really authentic Japanese style. I mean, the decoration. The building is not on, or, uh, tra authentic Japanese style because authentic Japanese style is uh, made of wood or something. Okay, this is the shrine at the center of the city. Maybe I can show you a little bit. Yeah, we are praying over there. And they are selling an army red as well. Here you are, you can buy amulet here.
okay and uh, I should show you one plate if you like to drink sake Japanese sake this store is really nice you know some some really famous sake is hard to look for and hard to buy but this store sometimes has a really nice famous popular sake you can buy there this is called Hasegawa Sake Ten Hasegawa, Hasegawa Sake Store so if you are really interested in sake maybe you can find a really nice one oh they are having some events here what kind of event Wow, look at that. It's a Japanese style garden. The water coming out from the bamboo. Making really nice sound. Yeah, they are having a marche from East Marche. Yeah, from East Marche. Okay. Okay. That's and gray. I found really unique sweet store. Look at that. Kingyo yaki. It's a goldfish, baked goldfish. Actually, not not a real goldfish, but uh, the shape of the sweet is a goldfish. It had a cho chocolate flavor, matcha flavor, and strawberry flavor. And the shop looks very great, you know, really Japanese style. It had a lantern here and red cloth on the table. Cool. It was interesting. Let me keep walking and uh, I think I want to go back to the main street because that street behind me had nothing to see. Bubble tea, you know, goncha. I'm back to Hasegawa Sake Store. This view, I like this view, you know. A sh shrine surrounded by a high, tall building. really Japanese style look at that this is the Edo period the picture of Edo period are so unique
Okay, let's go back to the main street of Nihonbashi. Look at the picture of the shop, Ebia. That is also the picture of the Edo period. It seems like people here are really proud of the Edo period and the Nihonbashi area. They use a lot of the uh, decoration or pictures of the Edo period. Really traditional and authentic one. This is the Koraido Muromach Terrace and the shopping center. This is the Mitsui Garden Hotel. It had a restaurant on the first floor. Okay, this is the Shin Nihonbashi Station and uh, I decided to walk around the Shin, Shin Nihonbashi area and we'll be ending this video Yeah, this is also the old Japanese restaurant and uh, it had a bento style. Some people may know that bento style. This one is also the Edo style. Look at that. 
and uh, I think this is a theater hall which is a very traditional one you know they're uh, I think doing a rakugo as well Oedoni. It is the name of the hall, Sierra Hall. Okay, Shin Nihonbashi area is like this. So, uh, the set in the center of Nihonbashi and the Mitsushima area, uh, there were so many uh, tall buildings and shopping center, department store but in this Shin Nihonbashi area uh, Shin means the new the new Nihonbashi area had uh, more like an office area like this, you know okay I think I will be ending this video here because I arrived at the Shin Nihonbashi area so if you like this video from uh, Nihonbashi area all the way to Nishin Nihonbashi area through uh, Mitsukoshimae or somewhere so please hit the like button for me and subscribe my channel and I, I hope you have a nice day see you guys